Today, I will show you two ways on how to place tags behind the objects. For more tutorials, make sure to subscribe and without further ado, let's get started. Place the video on the timeline and add the title on top. So, I will use the default title. On the second layer, what we want is for the text to go behind this building. So click on the title, go to advance, and type something. Let's say tutorial. Let's change the font. I will go with this one. I will adjust the text a little lower. After that, press OK. Okay, now it's time to make a sandwich. No, not like that. We need to add the same clip on the third layer. So, you should have the text in between. Next, go to Effects down to utility and add the image mask on the third layer we will hide the text and the first clip so it's easier to move the mask we only want to mask this building so click on the clip go to video effects first we will change the present mask we will go with this one and it's time to adjust it by adjusting the X and Y options. Change the placement of the mask. Just play with the width, height, X and Y until you get the right shape of the building. So this is enough. By the way, you don't have to mask the whole building. For example, let's show the text. You can also mask only this part but it all depends on what you want to do. So you don't have to mask this guy. Next, go to animation. Let's find the right curl animation so it's coming from the right. Okay, now let's see the final result. The second way is easier, but it only works for clips with high contrast, like this one. So go to Titles, add one on the second layer, click on it, go to Advance. Let's type Behind. Change the font to something else. I will go with this one and increase the size. After that is done, press OK. Then click on the title, go to video compositing, and change the blending mode to overlay. As you can see, the text is behind the plate. This is the final result. 